What's going on friends? How are you doing this year? Hopefully better. 2020 was something else, but I hope you're doing good. I am doing great. If you haven't been to my channel, my name is KG and my channel is called K in Kansas. For today, I want to talk about the pros and cons of leaving California. If you haven't made up your decision yet, or if you have made up your decision, these are the things that you might miss about California. And I'm going to also talk about things that you might not miss by leaving California. So here we go. If you have been thinking of moving out of California, you are not alone. 53% of its residents are actually thinking of moving out of California. 63% of those who are thinking of leaving California are millennials because they are so tired of the cost of living in Cali. But I'm feeling nice today, so I am actually going to start with the cons of leaving California. And so cons meaning these are the things you are going to miss about California. The number one con of leaving California is that your pay will be much lower in another state. I mean, let's get real. California's minimum wage is around $14 per hour, which is next to the highest ranking minimum wage per state, which is Washington, D.C. So if you are thinking of moving out of California to make more, think again. If you don't already have a job offer that would probably promote you or have you make more then maybe you should think about this. I do talk about those minimum wages and uh, medium household incomes and all those facts and data per state. So if you haven't yet, follow my channel or check out my other videos. The second reason why you might rethink your move out of California is that California is so conveniently located near everywhere you want to go or visit. Okay, so for us anyways, we were in the northern part of California and we were like 30 minutes away from Napa. We were about an hour and a half to the city, San Francisco. Um, we were about two and a half hours away from Tahoe. If you want to go ski, we're right there. And it's centrally located so you can hit up a beach. I mean, there's so much to do. But for us, we had more reasons to move out than stay in. But Yes, if you're in the southern part of Cali and you have the, the nice beaches in San Diego, you have Hollywood in LA if you're trying to be an actor or actress, right? Um, and there's just so much to do in Cali for families and for single people who want to mingle. Anyways, let's move on to number three. The third reason is that travel is so much cheaper coming from California because you have all of those like major airports like LAX, SFO, uh, SMF, San Jose. All those airports are major hubs for international flights. So if you're trying to catch a cheap flight somewhere, it will definitely be cheaper coming from those airports than let's say the airport here, ICT, you know, I mean, there's not a lot of direct flights, so it will definitely be more expensive. I remember when we were living in Cali, like sometimes I would hit up um, Google flights and that's how I find my deals. Uh, we actually got a flight going to Paris for $297. Yes, that was round trip and we took advantage of that and flew out. I mean, there's just so much deals uh, for you if you're near the major airports in California. So I would say that's a pretty substantial reason if you like to travel. The fourth reason why you should think of not moving out of Cali, I mean, for us, um, the great universities, are, you know, there's just so much universities in California. I mean, I'm not saying that there's not great universities outside of California, but it's definitely a drawback to move out of state if you are one of those parents that want to be super duper conveniently be close to your your son or daughter while they're going to college of course they will still have access to these great universities but you will be a state or two or three away just saying the number five reason why you shouldn't move out of cali this is probably like the most important one out of all of them for me anyways that the food scene is so much better in california i'm just saying don't hate but my 
love for Cali starts with the food, okay? I mean, let's get real. Food is everything. If you don't believe me, let me tell you. Facts, okay? Number one, these facts based on the average Yelp rating of top rated cuisines in the whole United States. So California is actually rated in the top five of these cuisines, Mediterranean, American, French, and Indian, okay? If you like that cuisine, you're gonna find the best rated restaurants of those cuisines in California. The second fact, California is overall fourth state. Who has the best food? I'm in Kansas. Uh, although the American food here is bomb. I like Thai food and I like dim sum and um, all those other cuisines we have to drive out for. And I mean, not it's not like 15 or 30 minutes. If I want great dim sum, I probably have to drive probably close to two hours, which hurts a little bit inside. But you know, I mean, I could probably make it myself at home. And for the third fact under this category, they actually rated the top 10 U.S. cities with the highest average Yelp rating of top rated cuisines in nine cities. Nine cities out of 10 of those ranking are from California. So, I mean, there's just good food in Cali, you know, I mean, from acai bowls to sushi to, I mean, I'm getting hungry right now, I haven't eaten breakfast, but you get the drift. So anyways, I don't want to get sentimental about California. I do miss it, but I am looking forward to what God has in store for us here in Kansas. I am getting excited. Our house is almost built. Uh, we have about three more weeks. If you haven't yet seen my new home tour, check it out. Oh, we wanted to share it with you. I will now tell you the pros of a leaving California. I'm going to give you reasons why you should consider moving out of Cali, okay? So for the first reason why you should move out of Cali, I mean, I mean, outside of California, there's just shorter commute times, not in every state, but if you're from California, you know how it is, especially if you live in the Bay Area, your, your commute time is probably between one to two hours one way. I mean, that's insane, you know? My husband used to drive like an hour and a half to two hours some days, and I myself was lucky enough to be able to, to take the train to work, and that was still about an hour uh, one way each day, so if you are looking into working somewhere with a shorter commute time definitely think of moving away from the city or away from the state that is the number one reason uh, for leaving california if you are sick and tired of the quality of life that you're living because of your commute time think about it two hours of commute time minimum is two hours you could have spent with your kids or you could have made a really nice home cooked meal. I mean, I wouldn't base my decision to move out of California just because of the shorter commute time, but it's something else to consider if you wanna get a hold of your life back by having more time for yourself or for your family. For the second reason why you should consider moving out of California is if you are starting a family, there might be some value in raising them in a smaller town with bigger values. I am going to leave you with this. It takes a village to raise a child. I believe that, okay? I mean, you can shelter your child as much as you want, but it really does take everyone else in your community to raise your child the proper way so hopefully that's something that i've helped you think about let's go to number three the third reason why you should think of moving out of california is of course cost of living i mean come on people it's so darn expensive to live in california and on top of that it is almost impossible for people to buy homes in california just because it's so darn expensive okay i mean i've talked about cost of living uh, outside of california in my other videos and i've talked about how much it costs to live in california but then again if that's something you don't mind i'm paying um just because yeah you do make more you spend more than 
all the better for you but if you are sick and tired of those cost of living hikes every year then definitely think about moving somewhere else you will probably buy a sprawling mansion in Texas for like hundred fifty thousand the fourth pro reason of moving out of California is come on taxes you are gonna be taxed up the hoo-ha uh, for state taxes and sales taxes if you haven't moved out of Cali and you're still paying those taxes it's alright you make so much more than everybody else anyways number five the pro reason of moving out of California is that dun 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 is better childhood education California is rated 37th 37 okay when they're looking into uh, pre-k to 12th grade rankings out of um, all the states those reasons I'm gonna say it's always a pro to move out of California to get better education if that's your primary reason why you're moving out of state then make sure you look at the rankings and do your research before you move out and the last reason why it's such a pro thing to move out of California is air quality. Did you know that California is rated as the most polluted state out of the country? Yes, that's pretty bad, especially if you have asthma. Six out of the 10 most polluted cities are found in California. So if you are in a big city, or even if you work in a big city, you're still inhaling that pollution, okay? Um, even if you're inside the house, your vents are still taking all that air in. Again, you might want to think about moving out of Cali if you are if you're respiratory compromised. Is that a thing? Is that a word? But you get my drift. That might be something you want to think about, you know, or maybe invest in a really, really amazing air purifier. That's always something you could think about. You're welcome. So anyways, those are my pros and cons of moving outside of Cali. And if you have already moved out of Cali, then you just listen to the, you know, the pros of, to make you feel better like me, okay? But if you are thinking about moving out of California, I have more reasons for you. It's on my other video. Um, I do uh, spit out a lot of facts and numbers. So if you are that type of person who loves numbers like me, then definitely give that a watch. But that's it for now, guys. Um, have a great day. Don't forget to like and subscribe. I hope that I help you live your fullest life ever. And happy 2021. I am so excited for us.